I am Marco. I am a founder, co-founder and designer of Pegasus 50. Pegasus 50 is intended to sail short-handed crew uh, on a longer uh, ocean passages. We are in the cockpit and cockpit extends nicely to the swimming platform. We have a sun and rain protection over cockpit with open cabrio roof. So roof can easily fold and open the view to the sky. In case one needs more air, we have a sliding opening here to get fresh air in and additional hatches on the roof. A foldable cockpit table with two leaves and the important part is a drawer freezer. Steering once again hydraulic connection to autopilots on each side. Besides steering wheel, it's a nice couch or helmsman seat, very comfortable to steer or for easy access to the foredeck. Electrical winches, primary and secondary, and below is a rope locker on the other side, storage for electrical cable. Only one step to swimming platform. Platform, of course, is, fold is foldable down, manually controlled with a oversized swim ladder. Easy access for a dinghy. This space here can take up to 2.8 meter long dinghy inflated. Comfort when you, while you sit is extremely important, especially the height of a backrest, so that you have good support of, of, of a back, higher above, so that you don't get tired, mainly while sailing you're, you're sitting. Width is increased to have a good sleep. One of the main features of Pegasus is how cockpit and salon are connected together. As you see, only two steps, a side sliding, side sliding door. So we considered that this would be one connected space. Galley is intentionally placed in this position so that whoever is working in the galley is at the same time connected to cockpit, to people sitting in cockpit, or of course, to the salon table. So the idea is that all this space works as one. A working top, two sinks, easy access, garbage bins, one daily fridge and a freezer drawer. This one could be a, a normal fridge or a deep freezer. Lots of space for food. There is another Work, worktop under the navigation seat with additional possibility for storage or deep freezer and another additional worktop. A nice separation and kind of a bar. If someone falls, this is a maximum distance one would, one would fall. There's, there's a lot of holds and handles for a longer night passages, you need a space where you want to control the boat and at the same time, you want to see outside. A very comfortable, very big chart seat. And from this position, you see the bow with all necessary information, autopilot and chart plotter radar in front of you. If you want to take a short nap, the idea is to put an additional cushion and one can have a very comfortable and safe position. This is a short-handed boat for a couple or couple and another couple or for a family. We believe that mainly salon table will be used as it is now in half. You have good, easy access into the corner where you comfortably sit and still have a connection with the one who is behind the steering wheel or in the cockpit. A table folds forward into very comfortable 
six person dining table. A table converts into the king size salon bed or lounger for kids to play or to read the book in the rainy days. Again, if you're inside, you're not disconnected, disconnected to the nature, you're outside as well. With open or closed door, doesn't matter, you still see what's happening around. We have developed a gimbal salon, which actually gimbals 10 degrees, port and starboard, to compensate the hill, which takes fatigue out. And this proved very, very practical for longer passages, again, to prepare food, to eat, and to, to sleep. On Pegasus 50, all cabins are located in the front part. So one step from saloon to main corridor. In the main corridor, we have one open berth, which serves as a, as a night watch. It could be also transferred into a double bunk. Around this bunk, there is a lot of easy access storage place for tools and replacement parts. Two easy access lockers, this one with shelves and the other one, a hanging locker. From the main corridor, we move into the front part, pass a shower, or a wet locker, a day toilet, easy accessible storage place for towels, clothes, and lower one for travel bags. So very important that you have space to place your travel bag. A front cabin with a big wee berth could be transferred into double separate berths with, again, storage place owner suit with a big double bed. We just move the night locker in between the two beds and this one is shifted to the side and we get a central access and the two separate beds. Drawer storage and hanging locker and shelves. Toilet and shower. with a real glass door, a wash basin, storage under the bench and above. All spaces are heated and ventilated. All lights are LED lights. So moving back to salon, there is easy accessible storage for glasses and food, plates, a wine locker and storage for tools and technical stuff. Underfloor storage in a bilge for drinks, easy accessible. Everything inside these lockers is organized in a plastic organizer. So the main feature of, of this boat, the interior and salon and cockpit is that everything is connected. So you see, going out and being inside is practically the same thing. We have placed all techniques into the three technical lockers. Very easy access. a step and you're in a lot of space for storage and very easy view, very easy control to the engine room in the center and all the systems. The same on the other side with electrics and electronics inside. A hatch to engine room which folds aft with the table and makes perfect access to the engine and generator. So service people, they love it because access is from both sides and from the top. More than half of, of the structure is built in carbon. Two reasons, one is to reduce weight and the other reasons is to, to make a sound and very strong structure which will last long. So for us, it's important that the boat works for the owners and that the boat keeps the quality and remain the value. She has a carbon rig, carbon mast, aluminum boom, ballast ratio is 40%. So 40% of the total weight of 12.3 tons is in the bulb and in the kill. From swimming platform, one step to cockpit and another step 
to the upper walking deck. So lots of holding for safe movement. We have a standard a solar panels, which are very useful when you're on the anchor or when the boat is moored in a marina just to maintain the batteries. Self-decker track for J2, very practical. Everything is organized in a way that one can handle the boat easily. So we have a carbon, carbon mast made by the builders of Imoka masts. One winch on the mast with halyards of J1, Genoa 1, Genoa 2 and Spinnaker 1. The other Spinnaker is led back to the cockpit. A very big lazy back makes a lowering of the sail very easy. J2, a small jeep, is endless, furled. Anchor locker with 75 meters of chain and oversized Lumar windlass with a chain stopper. Very practical solution. We have pop-up cleats. A 25 kilo anchor is stored under the carbon bowsprit. Each side has a gate. Very stable, very strong extensions and again a holding to get down or to climb up a very comfortable step and again a good holding.